Hello, and thanks for tuning in. Wednesday, January 27th, will have most Americans holding their breath as they wait to see who wins in this once-in-a-lifetime competition. You see, when Rabbi Mendel was planning his weekly class, he was debating if it should be on Tuesdays or Wednesday evenings. When the Obama administration found out about this, and knowing the popularity that this class will have, and also knowing that Obama will deliver a State of the Union address on Wednesday, they were able to convince Rabbi Mendel that his class should be on Tuesdays. But then, Rabbi Mendel's niece from Denver, Colorado, got engaged, and the wedding was scheduled for Tuesday, January 26th. Rabbi Mendel has no choice but to attend the wedding and reschedule the class for Wednesday. The Obama administration is very upset about this turn of events. There were reports of the administration planning to use this to prove that rabbis can't be trusted, but dumped the idea for risk of appearing anti-Semitic. In the meantime, Obama refuses to change the date of the State of the Union address, and Rabbi Mendel can't convince his sister to change the date of the wedding. So who will get more ratings this Wednesday? This is a very big deal for Obama, who is very concerned with the middle class and wants them to watch for their own benefit so that they can see how much he cares for them. But Rabbi Mendel contends that Torah can solve problems that even Obama could not, and it's more important for people to learn Torah. Fearing that Rabbi Mendel may get more ratings than Obama, and then he will not have to consider requests such as these from the administration anymore, the administration has agreed not to pester Rabbi Mendel anymore about scheduling, which might conflict with the president's popularity. Help Rabbi Mendel get the ratings he needs and get Obama off his back. Join the class this Wednesday, January 27th at 8 p.m. Looking forward to seeing you. And thanks for tuning in.